A story on values. This version is an adapted version which I am going to be telling you. A king was captured and the enemy instead of putting him to death had a very strange proposition. I have been struggling with a question. I need to know the answer. If you find the answer to this question, I will let you go. I will give you one year's time. If you can come back with an answer to my question, you are free or else I will enslave you forever. The captured king was more than delighted. Please ask me the question, what is it? The question that has been troubling me is, what does a woman really want? Ha! Is that all? I'm sure I'll be able to find out the answer. I will go back to my kingdom and return in a week's time with the answer. The captured king returned to ask the women folk of his kingdom. But each had a different answer to give. One said she, she valued youth. One said she valued her children. The other, everyone had different things to tell. And this left the poor king confused. Time passed and he was just the same place that he had been on the day he had returned. No answer to the riddle. Walking along his garden, one evening, he was pondering over this question. It was soon, soon going to be a year and he would need to go back and surrender himself and that is the integrity that was required of a king. When suddenly he heard a cackle, an old woman was sitting on a stone looking at him and laughing. <laughs> I know what troubles you. I have the answer. But I need you to do something for me. What? Who are you and what, what answer do you have? The answer to the question, what a woman really wants. You do? You have the answer? Yes. What do I have to do to know the answer? Well, you'll have to marry me. What? Marry you? This seemed like an unfair deal for the old hag had pus ridden skin, dried flaky hands and she really looked ugly. And the king was young and had a life to live. Yet he knew that he needed an answer and soon. All right, you give me the answer and I will marry thee. You will have to marry me in 24 hours. I cannot wait more than that. What? What is the hurry? You tell me the answer and I will marry you. You may not keep your promise. I am a king and I Always keep my promise. Well, in 24 hours, he was married. As the kingdom watched, the old hag married the prince of the kingdom, the king. Well, that night in the bedchamber, the king entered, feeling unsure whether he would get the answer whether he had done the right thing, but it was done in any case. He sat down on the bed and watched as the old woman hobbled her way right next to him, sat down and smiled. I am glad we have done this. Now give me a kiss. A kiss? Yes, we are married. I'm your wife, your bride. 
it must have been difficult for that king but kiss he did he had made the choice so he leant over and planted a kiss on that pus ridden skin when he opened his eyes it was no longer the old hag but a young woman what is this what magic what has happened well i must say that it is magic an evil witch had made me into an old hag because of her past problems with my father but she has left me in this form but even this i need to tell you i can be either young during the day and old during the night or old during the day and young during the night what do you choose my dear husband though the spell has been broken it is still not over the young king frowned what what is my choice over here it is your choice you choose what you would like to be young or old whichever time is your choice what <sighs> she embraced the king and this time when they kissed the young woman the old hag who had become the young woman smiled and said you have passed the test in so many ways dear king you have broken the spell for that is exactly what a woman really wants have you forgotten that question I have not but what is the answer you have given the answer a woman wants sovereignty the freedom to make her own choice that is what you have shown by asking me to choose so go tell the king go tell the enemy that is the answer a woman needs the freedom to choose sovereignty the king went back to the enemy and once the answer was revealed he was pardoned and returned to rejoice and live a happy life with his bride knowing that the freedom to choose is what a woman really wants the story task is for you to identify what you value the most what value do you think you uphold in life the most